y'all pamela here welcome back to my channel it's been a while it's maybe been like a month since i have either like recorded or maybe like since i've uploaded a video um but hey y'all so today is monday i think it's like august 29th i think something like that today i am getting a relaxer after like five months um i had braids and senegalese twists all throughout the summer because it was just too damn hot to have no hair on my head on my face it was too hot for all of that um so since the end of may i haven't had a relaxer so that's what uh june july august september no june july august it's like three months three four months um since i've had my last relaxer way too long um so i'm going today i'm getting a relaxer really getting the works a relaxer trim treatment um and i'm getting a u-part wig installed as well so i'm really excited about that one thing i love about being i love about being relaxed is just the versatility i've done so many styles to check in it's like two o'clock i have three more hours of working from home left so i'm just making myself some lunch working and then right after this i'm gonna dash out because my appointment is at six and i'm just super excited so love y'all and i will catch y'all in the next clip a few moments later all right y'all so at this point i was at the salon shout out to my hairstylist jasmine i found her on style seat i'm not gonna lie i'm probably not gonna share her information with you guys because she gets booked really really quickly and y'all i can't have y'all booking my girl to where i can't see her anywho the clip you just saw was of her basically like priming my scalp um, I think she used Vaseline, but Vaseline, petroleum jelly, anything like that will be fine to protect your edges, your ears, and your scalp from um, the relaxer, which is a chemical, of course. Um, and now she's just working the relaxer through my hair. FYI, she's using olive oil relaxer. Um, when I first started coming to her, I used a firm because that's what my previous hairstylist used in um, my first relaxer video that I did a year ago. Um, the olive oil I actually find works just fine. I don't know if it's the way that she applies it or what, but I don't get any of those like calluses that you can sometimes get on your scalp from a relaxer. And I've been getting those on my scalp from the beginning of time. I also have a very sensitive scalp, but y'all, I don't know what it is about um, my stylist Jasmine, but literally I don't get any of that on my scalp and my scalp scalp is really really sensitive um so yeah she's just great so i feel like one of the keys to having healthy hair period but especially healthy relaxed hair is finding a great stylist and going to them consistently when i go to her consistently um which i have been for not the last year but since maybe like february um my hair has been doing great as you can tell my hair is flourishing it's healthy i took three months off from the relaxer just because it was summer and i didn't want hair on my neck um or on my face but my hair has been doing great another thing that i found that's been helpful is whenever i take out like my braids or twists or whatever um i do imme immediate like hot oil treatment with castor oil or lune mascotte if you're haitian um <laughs> Uh, so I do that right when I take the braids or the twists out before I wash it. I let it sit in the oil um, on my scalp and on my hair, especially on the ends as well. Um, for maybe 30 minutes or if I'm around the house doing stuff, you know, I'll have it sit while I'm doing stuff. And then I'll proceed to like do the shampoo and conditioning of my hair. Um, and that's helped a lot, a lot, a lot with shedding. Because for me, if I don't get my consistent relaxers, my hair starts to shed a lot. Um, but with the protective styles, of course, I'm not getting the relaxers. Um, so that hot oil treatment I find has been like a game changer. Um, so yeah. Anyway, so as you can see, she's working this relaxer into my scalp. Um, this whole process of the relaxer itself from like start to finish was like about 20, 22 minutes. Um, and the relaxer wasn't on all of my hair at once for a very long time because my scalp started burning. It was probably just sensitive because I had just washed it like maybe two or three days before to get all the gunk out from the Senegalese twist that I just took out. Um, but the perm actually really did a great job. I was really surprised that um, all of my new growth ended up taking to the perm because my hair literally was so thick. The way y'all saw it in the beginning was the way it was after I put a hot blow dryer to it. Like I really blow dried my roots a lot before coming in because I didn't want it to be so like hard and matted for her. And it was still that thick y'all. Like I have for real, for real 4C hair, but I love it. Um, so yeah, this next part, of course, she's watching, washing the relaxer out with a neutralizing shampoo so once you rinse the relaxer out the chemical is still active in your scalp and on your hair that's why they use a neutralizing shampoo to like neutralize that chemical so that the relaxer stops working um it took a couple of washes for my scalp to stop burning but once a couple of washes were done we were all good and of course she put a treatment on my hair 
also another thing that has allowed my hair to be healthy so a lot of people only do like the treatment where you like um where they put it on your head and then you sit under the dryer for like 30 minutes or so people typically only do that when they get relaxers but i do it every single time i go to the hair salon so that my hair is nice and healthy because just like with natural hair you would deep condition it ever so often or whatever the case is but i want to make sure that my relaxed hair or my hair in general is just really really healthy so every single time i go for a wash whatever it is i always have her do the treatment as well not just when i um, and i won't do get the i won't do in. for your body so give me all you got right now i know i'm yours baby so come give me love you know you're my baby so come give me love i never felt nothing quite like this i get a high every time we kiss can't get enough baby When I'm with you, my legs go weak, hey. can you hear it? I think my heart just skipped a beat, hey. This feeling is getting so strong Love me so the morning, love me all night long There's something special about all right y'all don't judge me i wanted to get some footage of me under the dryer for y'all but listen i was hungry i just came from work and i had to grab some food on my way there so uh shout out to panda express <laughs> don't judge me y'all typical you know black hair salon stuff but she has i love the way she has her um hair styling set up um the wash wash bowls are like communal but as you can see like the room where your hair is done it's private room and then there's a separate room with just dryers and no one was in the room with just dryers so i was fine to like be eating by myself and not distract <laughs> So here, as you can see, she's just blow drying my hair. And if y'all, you look at my hair and the way it is now and the way it was a year ago, it's crazy. Between now and when I got my first relaxer, I've cut it multiple times just to keep it in the short cut. And my hair will probably be some level of short, you know. Honestly, it's not in my genetics to have hair down my behind. We kind of bald headed over here. So this is a big improvement for me, y'all. This is big and my goal is not to have long hair it's just to have healthy hair because again i've accepted my lot in life we the bald headed gang over here it's okay but i have really thick hair that's really healthy so you know i'm very thankful for that i actually kind of rather have the hair that i have especially when it's relaxed than to have long hair that's thinner because it's really hard to get hair that's thicker if it's thin but as y'all can tell i have 4c hair and to make it more manageable and just in the way i like it i just relax it and i really love that for me My hair grows in the form of a short cut. So the top is long, yeah, top is long, short on the side, I think this side is short on that side, and the back is the shortest. So my hair literally grows in the form of a short cut. Fun fact. Now this is crazy. <laughs> of the weekend but i still wanna turn up yeah i still wanna turn up all i want is to go again but you ain't picking your phone up why you messing my head up any night any day let me take you away all i need is just saying yeah 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 better nights better days when you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me When I need you most We got love guaranteed Y'all, let me tell you about these braids As I told y'all earlier in the video I have a really sensitive scalp um, Especially like with really anything I have a really sensitive scalp but let me tell you, the way I didn't feel any pain with these braids at all, and sometimes I find that when I'm getting my hair done in like some sort of braids or something, 
it doesn't feel tight when they're doing it but then afterwards i feel like it's like super duper tight um but literally it's been a couple days later now that i'm you know recording this voiceover and my scalp still feels great my like scalp isn't itching out of control or anything like that so listen find you a good hairstylist i feel like that's definitely one of the keys to having healthy um relaxed hair Y'all, I'm so sorry. I didn't realize my camera wasn't going, like it wasn't on when she was putting the U-part itself on my head. I really wanted you guys to be able to see that, but kind of think of it basically as a removable sew-in. At this point, she just used um, the clips to install the wig itself. Um, that's what she's doing now, adjusting the clips. And then she went around and sewed around the perimeter of the wig, including around the perimeter of where um, I have leave out as well. And again, I found Jasmine on Style Seat. Um, the stylist that I was using previously, she's great, but I just needed something different and I just felt like my time was up there, which is fine. No blood, bad blood towards hair, towards her. <laughs> um, she still does great hair, but I just wanted somebody new. Um, there was one time when Jasmine wasn't available and I needed to get my hair done um, to go out of town. So I did go to someone else that I found on Style Seat, but honestly, Jasmine's just the best to me. Um, so yeah, on whenever, wherever you live, go on Style Seat and find someone that specializes in relaxers or at least does relaxers and it's going to be trial and error but once you find that stylist that's key and another thing that i always do i set my next appointment typically before i leave the current appointment that i'm at so that i know when my hair is getting done next i can plan for it financially so i don't know when i'm going to spend the money and also my girl she gets booked so i don't want to have to hit her up two days before asking for a squeeze in and she doesn't have it but for me it lets me know no my hair is getting done and again that's keeping the health of my hair because i'm constantly It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day, let me take you away. All I need is just saying yeah. yeah. y'all again i'm so sorry my phone was acting up as you can see she was starting to press my leave out um and she ended up doing curls for the rest of my head y'all are about to see the finished product in a second now that i'm looking at it from this perspective i kind of like the wavy look but i feel like it gives me like auntie but like not like the rich auntie just like weird auntie i don't know um so this is the u part wig i absolutely love it i probably i might like sew a couple more bundles in it just to give it a little added fullness but overall i love that i was going for like a rich auntie look and i think that's exactly what I got. Love y'all. Tell me where you be, be cause I gotta know. Let me know when you're ready. Cause I may